want to come over here so you can see a little better. That's fine. You can see as we turn. Uh, what Vidal's is doing is basically just keeping it in the center. You want to drill a straight hole. But every once in a while he's pushing down too. You really don't have to push down as much as you'd think. The tool will do the cutting for you if you want it. Uh, you can start to see the dirt is filling up inside. And so I'm going to say Vidal's push down a little bit more. And that will allow the tool to continue to grab it. And we'll just keep doing this kind of slow and smooth. David and I will until that bucket is full. Take it out. Now keep your hands, try and keep, each of you try and keep both your hands on the handles at all times. That way one of you doesn't let go and think, oh, the other one's got it. And then sure enough, it goes falling down the well. <laughs> Seen that happen. <laughs> People start saying, oh, why did you drop that? Get things started a bit for the, for the auger to work properly. Pour water in there to help make it soft. Sometimes you can do that. Oh, dear. That's what you're talking about. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Which right now, not a big deal, right? We can just reach down there and pull it. But if that thing's 90 feet deep and that thing goes falling, everybody looks at him and goes, oh. Way to go, Colby. Okay, Alexis. Well, pretty far, you know. Oh. We are bad well drillers. <laughs>